Hey, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another segment of the TMA Radio Show tonight. It is Sunday night. You're listening to the best gospel praise talk show in America. I'm your host, Minister Agnes, tonight. And we we bless the Lord tonight. We bless God for just a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful day today. Amen. We thank and praise God for who he is. Amen. And, And God is our healer. God is our deliverer. He's our way maker. He's ever, ever, everlasting. Amen. Beginning and the end. We love God because he first loved us. And every praise should be to our God. If we had 10,000 tongues, we still could not praise our God enough. Look at how he blesses us. Look at, look at how he keeps us. And even when we mess up, he continued to look out and bless us each and every day. Amen. Hey, we thank you for listening, and we will be coming up with the weather shortly. So we want you to just sit back and relax. Amen. And I want to say happy Mother's Day to all the mothers in the world. Not just here in America, but in the world. And I tell you, I think uh, me and my sister was talking, and we think our mother had a wonderful, wonderful Mother's Day. Amen. I'm telling you, we blessed her so goodly, so good today, amen, and you know, we just thank you, praise God for being able to be able to be a blessing to our mother, because even though we give her a little bit, it's nothing compared to what she done over the years in our life, so we want to just continue to say happy Mother's Day and enjoy the show.
There aren't even words to describe just how great you are in all your majesty. You continually provide for me. There just isn't anything that you can't do. Lord, I've seen so I'll trust you all the more because you are you are the sovereign God sovereign God and you're bigger than all bigger than all my problems every and every situation there is there is nothing, nothing too hard for the sovereign So I will put every situation into your capable hands. I don't have to know the plan because you are. You are the sovereign God. You're bigger than Man, there's nothing too hard for God. There's nothing, nothing too hard for God. Amen. God is, woo, God is God is good. All right, we're going to go to the weather. Amen. Amen. The weather forecast tonight. We're looking at a chance of rain. Lower 65 degrees. We're looking at Monday. Thunderstorm. Mostly cloudy. High of 84 with a low of 67. Tuesday, high of 90 with a low of 62, chance of thunderstorm. Wednesday, high of 80 degrees with a low of 57. Thursday, high of 76 with a low of 54. Friday, mostly cloudy, high of 78 with a low of 55. Saturday, chance of thunderstorm, high of 78 with a low of 61. And that's your seven day forecast. Amen, God is good. Amen, God is great. 
we love God, amen. Hey, this week focus, uh, this week focus is for you guys and myself, all the listeners across the world. This week focus is loving thy neighbor. Write that down, put that on, put it on your calendar. Amen. This week focus is loving thy neighbor. Amen. Hey, if you need prayer, you get prayer. You need prayer. Do you need prayer? Everybody could use prayer. We pray one for another. Amen. Corporate prayer. Amen. But if you need prayer right now, amen. Go to the lines. The nine lines number is 919-526-4916. Leave a message, amen, and uh what you want prayer about, amen. Again, the number is 919-526-4916. Call us up for prayer. Amen. All right, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna tap into a uh, a little clip, Amen, of of sermon, uh, Amen, by yours truly, Reverend Nino Agridge, Amen. Uh, going into the new year, Amen. I was uh, blessed to be able to preach at uh, Hickory Grove a Baptist Church, and we're gonna play a little bit of this uh, for you, Amen. church amen i give honor to my lord and savior jesus the christ of nazareth amen to my pastor and her absent and to the shepherd of this house amen my father my friend mentor classmate amen pastor thomas and to first lady amen bless you and to his daughter out there singing the praises of god in praise and worship. Oh, uh, that was an awesome welcoming of the Spirit to this place. Amen. Something about when you set the atmosphere right. When you get the atmosphere right, the Holy Ghost will take control. All we have to do is just get it right. He'll take over. Amen. 
Tell your neighbor, there's a word tonight. Amen. Amen. I will hold your attention tonight to the uh, book of Exodus 14 chapter. Amen. While you're turning 14 chapter, and we'll be starting at verse 5, but I will be skipping around. Amen. But you can read that entire chapter at another time. I do give honor to my lovely wife that introduced me. Amen. My, my baby. Y'all. Amen. Amen. My mom in the back. Amen. I see you. Bless you. Amen. Pressed her way on. Amen. They didn't ride down the ECU. They came back. I thank God that she's here. Amen. To the choir. Amen. To sing in God's praise. Talking about when you sing to God's heart. Amen. Amen. To the first gentleman of Nelson, amen. He's here, amen. Amen. We thank God for him in the house, amen. And all the other ministers and deacons, amen. Friends, saints, members, everyone in the house. If you're there in Exodus 14, chapter 5th verse, say amen. 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 The word of God tonight, it says, And it was told the king of Egypt that the people fled. And the heart of Pharaoh and of his servants were turned against the people. And they said, Why have we done this? That we have let Israel go from serving us. Verse 8, And the Lord hardened the heart of Pharaoh, king of Egypt. And he pursued after the children of Israel. And the children of Israel went out with a high hand. Verse 10, and when Pharaoh drew nigh, the children of Israel lifted up their eyes, and behold, the Egyptians marched after them. And they were so afraid. And the children of Israel cried out unto the Lord. But then there's something happened in verse 13. It says that, and Moses said unto the people, fear not. Stand still and see the salvation of the Lord, which he will show you today. For the Egyptians whom you have seen today, ye shall see them again no more forever. The Lord shall fight for you. The Lord shall fight for you, and ye shall hold your peace. Amen. Let us pray. Heavenly Father God, we thank you for just your presence right now, Lord God. We thank you for being good to us all day, God, all week, God, all month, God, and all year. God, you've been so wonderful, God. Through everything that we endure, God, you have been just wonderful, God. Amen. God, we ask if you just touch now this service. Ah, God, just touch in a mighty way, God, that somebody be delivered, somebody recover, somebody be set free. Yeah, God, that they give you the praise, that they give you the glory and the honor. And God, we ask if you continue to touch those that are sick, those that are feeble in their bodies, God. Ah, God, touch them, God, with a finger of love. Strengthen them, God. Let them know that you're still still on the throne and that you're still in the healing business. And God, we ask if you just bless those that are bereaving. God, we have a lot of people that are bereaving right now, that have lost loved ones. God, we know you're still a comforter, Lord. Comfort them, God, right now, God. Let them know that you still love them, Lord. And have your way, Lord. God, I ask if you just continue to bless this nation, Lord. Our God, touch our leaders, God, that they want to live right, that they want to serve you right, God, that they want to serve the people right, Lord, God. That they may lead in a mighty way, Lord. Yes, God. And God, continue to bless our demand service, God. The preachers, the teachers, God. The bishops and pastors, God. The lay people, God. Bless them in a mighty way, God. Our God, continue to bless this pastor of this church, Lord. Continue to bless his family. Continue to just anoint him, God, from head to toe, Lord. And God, my pastor. Oh, God, touch your body right now in the name of Jesus, God. We know that you're still a healer, God. We know that you're an old time. Jesus, God. Oh, 
Oh God, strengthen her, God. Oh God, continue to anoint her, Lord. Oh, touch her husband, God. Oh God, her help me, Lord. Keep up, continue to strengthen him, Lord. Continue to uplift him, Lord Jesus. Hey God, we love you tonight. We love you tonight and bless our children, Lord. Uh, those that are faced with all kinds of problems, Lord. All kinds of issues, Lord. Touch our children, God, the innocent ones, Lord. Protect their way, Lord. And God, everybody under the sound of my voice, Lord, tonight, with any kind of sickness, God, with any kind of ailment, Lord, if there's sugars, Lord, God, continue to bring it up to, to good levels now, God. Anybody with low blood pressure, Lord, my God, we know you can fix it right now in the name of Jesus. Anybody on drugs right now, God, we declare it's defeated right now in the name of Jesus. Anybody that have any doubt in their mind of who they are sexually, God, we know that you're a way maker, God, to turn their life. and honor and we thank you for this, thank this day. Jesus. In Jesus' name, amen. Jesus. Amen. Jesus. amen. You may be seated. Amen. Jesus. Tell somebody a new season, a new season. and a new beginning. A new ah, so if somebody asked you, where did you go last night? Did you go to the club? You said, no, I didn't go to the club. I went to have some church. Right. And in church, they told me the topic tonight was a new season and a new beginning. Uh, do I have anybody that can believe it tonight? Do I have any believers tonight? That, that whatever your current situation is, that before you leave right now, tonight is going to be changed. Oh, uh, I believe it. I believe it. Amen. Stay right there. I'm going to just bless the Lord. Thank you.
I just want to thank you. Amen. We're going to be playing a little bit more of that um, tomorrow. Amen. I just want to thank you. Amen. We'll go to the word. Amen. Tomorrow night. So come on back. Amen. Tomorrow and check out. Amen. Amen. I'm telling you, God is good, isn't he? I'll tell you one thing. God is so good. God is so, so good. Hey, if you have a business, we want to get your products and services out at a very low, low price. So if you have a business and you want us to advertise, email Minister Show at gmail.com. Again, if you have a business in the local area of the 919-252 area code, Raleigh, Durham, Lewisburg, Henderson, Bunn, Youngsville, Franklinton, and all other, you got a small business, need to get it out, we'll get that information out for you. Email Minister Akron Show at gmail.com. Hey, we want you to understand that it's tick season, and we want you to make sure that you check your children. Hey, check your kids when they come in from outside. Have a friend of mine, co worker of mine, grandson, was in the hospital. We're going to pray for that young little boy, the little toddler, got bit by a tick. Had Rocky Mount fever, spotted fever, and uh, they say he's doing good. So we want to just to remind you that check your children if they're out in the grass in the weeds. Make sure you check them. All right. Now we're going to continue the best show around, and you know we want you to call up whenever you need to call up, or if you're listening to me live right now. You can click the instant message button. We have community talk, regardless of if I have a topic or not. If you have something to say about your community, you can hit us up, 919-521-4741, or instant message, send an instant message right now, and tell me what's on your mind, what's in your town that's going down, and we'll get it out there, your concerns. And if, hey, if your town doing good, great. Let us know what your town is doing that's great. And we might can add some of that to what we've got going on in our town. All right. So we want to be in mind for be mindful that we're gonna pray one for another. We're gonna be mindful that this week focus is loving thy neighbor. I know it's hard sometimes to love people that come against you. I know it's hard to love people when they 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 show race racism against you because of the color of your skin. I know it's hard sometimes for people uh, to love people when they're envious of you, but God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believeth in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. That's what I'm talking about. Whosoever believeth shall have everlasting life. Amen. We got one minute left. Amen. On the show. Hey, we want you to meet us here tomorrow between 7 and 8. Amen. If there is a change, I will announce that on Facebook. Amen. So if you want to, uh, you know, send me a, a request or a like, like my uh, Facebook page, The Minister Accurate Show, you can uh, search that. The Minister Acker Show and click a like. Amen. So love somebody tonight. Say your prayers tonight. And we're gonna ask God to cover all those that were in the storms. Pray that God continue to bless those, touch those, because he's in control. That everyone be safe and watch out for each other. Until next time, I love you with the love of the Lord. That's why I pray for the They got till midnight to get that fix. They got till midnight to stop out all jealousy, all pettiness, all unforgiveness, all strife, all malice, all confusion, all blaming other people for your mistake. You got till midnight to get rid of every poison that's hindering you, every inflexibility that's stopping you from what God is about to pour into your life. Woe be unto you if you were to another year and waste another year with the old mentality while somebody's in the hospital begging God for the opportunity.
Right now, you better step into this. Place. 